It's so loud. <laughs> I always forget how loud this game is. But, hooray! Hi! How are you all doing? We are here, once again, with DuckTales. So this is the remastered version, obviously, of the classic NES game. And I'm very excited to hopefully finish it today. Um, one of the nice things about NES games is that they tend to be very short. Um, so yeah, you can see the only one I'm allowed to do is the Himalayas. I was really close to beating it last time. I was. I was at the Yeti. Stupid Yeti. Let's do it. Hey, look, it's Rev and Merthewin. Hello to both of you. Hope that things are going well. I myself am... I'm already exhausted today. I've, I've had a busy morning. I'm really excited though for um, for anybody who watches my stuff. Well, I guess it's just Rev, um, but anyone who cares about my fishy stuff. So I'm really excited because um, I got my new fish moved out um, from the separate tank today. So I'm really excited. It's been, it, it feels like it's been forever since I've added new fish. And so I'm super excited. But hello to TH as well. Closed on the house. Yes! Yeah, I saw that, Rev. It's very exciting. Rev gets to move into the fancy new house. So that's going to be amazeballs. I'm super jealous. New fridge and stove. Nice! Look at Big Pimpin over here. Are you going to get one of those fancy, um, one of those fancy ones? Uh, one of the fancy stoves um, and fridges. So, oh my god, right? So, I, I'm sorry, I, I don't mean to hijack you here, Rev, but it's hilarious. One of the, um, um, so some of my external work that I do, um, one of the people that I work with um, was saying that um, their family is remodeling their kitchen and they got a new fridge and it's one of those ridiculous, I think it's a Samsung that has the screen in it. And she was, and uh, my client was saying, it's like, yeah, my dad was so excited because it's like, oh, look, we can, we can tweet from the fridge and we can watch TV. It's like, why on earth would you want to tweet from your fridge? <laughs> on top of that fact, she would say that uh, the dad doesn't even tweet. It's ridiculous. It doesn't make any sense. So yeah, it just, it's ridiculous. So whatever you do, Rev, please don't get one of the stupid, <laughs> One of the stupid Neela's screen-enabled fridges, because it makes no sense to have them. But wait, what's this? Oh, cool! Tiny got a phone! Well, that's fun. Congratulations to Tiny. I hope that she's responsible with it. And not surprising to uh, block everything. I think that's probably the most reasonable thing to do my opinion but I mean obviously I don't have kids so I don't really know much about any of it ah shiny did I get the thing I did not so I need to go first you're not getting a smart fridge okay good I'm glad that you are not getting a smart fridge because seriously, it's just about the dumbest thing ever. I just, I, I do not see any purpose to it. Oh, come on! That was clearly nobody's fault. I don't know if all of you saw how faultless everyone was on that. The answer is completely false. But yeah, it was just... And, and it's like, you, you have a camera inside the fridge so that you can see what is inside the fridge. And I'm just like, why does anybody need that? It just, it, it makes so little sense. Not to mention the fact that it's like, oh great, it's another device that can track everything that we do. Uh, it's... I don't get it. Like I said, it's not for me personally. 
But either way, that is really awesome, Rev. Congratulations to you and the Mrs. Rev. I just call her the Mrs. Rev. It's just easier for me. I am also glad that people agree that it's stupid. This guy is cool. Get him. Oh, poor bunny. But I hope that otherwise everybody had good weeks as well. Hi, I got this. I don't think I got it last time. I had a feeling that was gonna happen. But yeah, good times. Dang it! No, I need that! Yeah, once again, I, I personally had another ridiculously crazy week this week. Um, it seems like that's all I can do lately. Oh no, the big one! I guess it's not too big of a deal, but still. It sucks to feel like I'm not really progressing with much of anything, you know? But I try. Alright. So we gotta get back to launch pad. close to the end of this level now. Like I said, I remember having done it before. I did it last week. And I almost won. It's this close. We'll see. Alright, so this basically takes me to the next part of the level. Oh, I forgot about this part. So this is the last section of the level, and you can see there's not much to go. So you see on the map, there's just like a few little things that I have to jump through, basically, and then I'm there. Aw, oh, man. 
All right, so this is the boss level. This reminds me of Mega Man X, or any of the Mega Mans, right? You go through the little door and you have like the little ch ch It's basically what this feels like. It's frustrating because, um, ah, trying to avoid getting stomped on. Thankfully, I've got enough health that I'll be. Maybe, okay. I think I actually have more health this time than I did last. Oh, shoot, I missed. Ugh, made it. Dang it. So this game is weird because instead of doing um, instead of doing your typical um, three cycles for a boss fight, it makes you do four. So now I just gotta wait until he's under there, pop him, and that should be it. Oh shoot, that's not it. Oh god. Okay, so it takes like five! Dang it. This is really aggravating. Stupid Yeti. Dang it! Hitboxes! Grr! Frustration! Annoyance! Spiteful hate! Okay, that was frustrating. Oh, yeah. Oh, come on! Like, I, okay, it seems like I can stand right next to his toe, and I'll be okay. Whatever, Rev, if the death counts. Oh, yeah! I barely missed his toe hitbox. Now, I'm making the assumption that when he does the the little shaky drop thing, that I'm not allowed to be underneath him. Oh, come on! Or rather, I'm not allowed to be on the ground uh, because it'll hurt me if I get hit. Makes it way easier. I could have just jumped onto this other side. Nobody told me it was that simple. I did it! Yay! This monster tried to pummel me. Why, I nearly cast my last check. 
Guidebook doesn't have. I'm thinking that you like the second point. half of the Junior Woodchuck Guide is basically the Necronomicon. Here's your thorn, Wethergale. <laughs> the lost crown of Genghis Khan. Really? <laughs> cool. We got it. Got them NES style sound effects, yo. Uh oh. We did it, boys. All five treasures are mine. <laughs> uh, boys? Uh oh. <gasps> Beagle Boys! They're Sorry taking the cheese! That, but your meddlesome nephews are a wee bit tied up at the moment. Lintheart Glongold, you put the Beagle Boys up to this. Guilty as charged, Scroogey. I've been the world's second richest duck long enough, but these treasures will soon change that. <laughs> oh, yeah. tell your goons to release my boys. Not till you fork over that last treasure. The Don't number one dime? Don't do it! The way I see it, Mad Duck, you're not in much of a position to argue. Oh, the crown. Uh, I, you drive a hard bargain, Glomgold. Take it, you filthy cheat. <laughs> Flint heart, Glomgold, the richest duck in the world. How does it feel to be number two, Scroogey? Ah! <laughs> Magic as a spell. Oh, it's so rude of me to drop in unannounced. What are you doing here, Magica? Oh, quick, somebody sound the alarm. Duckworth, Mrs. Bigley, call the Pentagon. Send me stuck in bonds. <laughs> Not so fast, fool. What the Rudy of the Scrooge? I can't move. Me neither. Now I know how a statue feels. Eh. Greedy old fool. These treasures are far more valuable than money. And just what do you mean by that? You find secrets hidden inside old paintings, yes? Yeah? Painting of Drake Von Bloodstone, also known as Count Dracula Duck. These treasures are part of spells to summon him. Uh -oh. Ah, what rubbish. You will see, with power of Dracula Duck under my command. I will rule the world. No, the treasures. Oh, but uh, you rather surrender number one dime, Scrooge. Diamonds must tempt the way to conquer world. We'll save a great deal of trouble. Also, let's risk an accidental Dracula bite. The uh. first dime I ever made? Never. Then I will take precious nephews instead. You will bring me down quickly enough after that. No! Give us our hostages. Find your own. Quiet, Eagle Boys. <laughs> now I take leave. Bring number one guy to my home and mount the Suvius in 24 hours. Or little nephews will become Dracula for Dracula. Yes. Oh no, you guys! What are we gonna do? Oh, oh dear. Sometimes I still get carried away. The lousy, no good so and so. I stole those treasures. <laughs> I'm going to assume that we have to team up. Yes, we are teaming up. We just don't have time for all this. We don't have time for this nonsense. 
Ah, evil bat! Now remember our deal, Vinny. Help me rescue the lads, and the treasure is yours. You keep up Aww. your end, and I'll keep up mine. <laughs> wow, this is a big one. I don't trust that. The bats in this game are kind of stupid. I'm not going to lie. I forgot that I can bounce on spikes. It makes no sense, but I can. Wow, rude. Did you see how rude that dude was? any of these stupid treasure chests. It's probably just because I don't know nothing. Dang it. I am getting killed. Literally. I'm glad that the diamonds are here, just floating in midair to tell me exactly where I can jump. It's very helpful. It's just, it's so assistive. Oh, look at this. It's like Limbo. Right? That was the game, Limbo? Finally got something. Ah, dang it. I blame Red. Everybody okay with that? You blame Red for that? I think it was quite clearly his fault, so. gotta use fancy Star Wars numeration for the numbers now. We don't need no Roman numerals.
This silhouette thing is kind of weird. Oh, sure, now there's a cake. A little bit late. Really could have used that a while ago. Not that I died or anything, but... So I need the rock to pop up. It's nice that you can hop on the spikes. That is tremendously helpful. This game would be way harder if you couldn't. I was about to say, this looks secret-ish. I'm close to the end, though. Cart. Shoot. I'm I'm not very good at these. I always seem to have the worst luck when it comes to that part. Thankfully we got it. Uh, I have to be awful trusting of that. Oh, come on. I was busy looking at the shinies. Ooh, that was close. So I don't know where the final boss is, but apparently um, in, in this game, whatever the final boss is, one of the issues that this version has, this uh, the remastered version has, is the game crashes um, before the final boss fight actually starts. And apparently it still hasn't been fixed on the Steam version of this game. Um, so I don't know if that's still true. I guess we might see. Um, again, I don't know if this is the final boss coming up. If it is, then I'm in big trouble. cake, so... Oh! Okay. You know what? I have a feeling this is exactly how super rich people behave. They just randomly meet and talk to each other and argue over who has more pennies. Or dimes, I guess, in this case. Oh, not until you show me number one dime. Here it is. Now let the voice squash. It's been great to have been there for you, Scrooge. I've been backstabbed. You've been Kahoot not again. The Kahoot, no. Do you remember who sold your painting in first place? It was me in disguise, you fool. Why, you... No wonder it was such a bargain. Huh. I found a painting for you, saved the expensive treasure of the expedition for me. And now, as long as I have huh. found treasures to complete spells. Exactly, it's... E pen measuring of billionaires. But that's what I mean. It's I I fully believe that this is exactly what happens. No time for buyers remorse from old Hamden. Back to Sequin Master Plan. It is much more exciting. I now summon Dracula Lock. Uh oh. No the treasures! Oh, 
building. Dang it. So I'm thinking I need to use the bat to basically jump a little higher so that I can jump. Holy free holies! Okay, seriously, how am I supposed to do this? There we go. I don't know what I'm supposed to do! No! Hey, Duck's working worth his back. You're leaving because of brunch? You're abandoning me for brunch, Marathuin. I just want to clarify this. I am being abandoned for brunch. Not cool. I do not approve. Why can't it have saved where I was? We know that he's the bad guy. Or a bad guy. But see, now I know I can get all these treasures. Pancakes. Fun. I like pancakes. I normally make my own pancakes though. I'm cool like that. I'm not lame and smelly like Nerfman. Wait for it. Eh. Although let's be real, none of this really matters. Oh, come on, I hit him. Well, enjoy your pancakes. I hope that they're delicious. Even though they'll taste like treachery. I don't know how to get past those. having some pancakes right now, but I'm, I'm trying to... I'm still doing my diet thing, at least mostly. I mean, I admit I cheat on occasion. One of the things with dieting, though, is you have to cheat. Like, if you don't, if you don't cheat a little bit, then you'll never be able to succeed. Hurry up, I'm growing old! It's one of like the fundamental concepts of dieting, essentially, is that it's psychologically it's very difficult to maintain for any extended period of time. I don't remember what's in there. I think it's just a gem. But let's see. I just hate that I have to go through all this again. I know I'm reasonably close to health, which is good. Okay, here. And then this one I have to jump. Oops. sad because I don't get I, I'm not gonna have time for lunch because I gotta get to work in not too long but you all know that's how it be it's what we do
So see, this is frustrating, um, trying to figure out the mechanics for the boss. It's one of the things that I don't like about games like this. Um, especially the basically just old school games in general, is that it was always frustrating to figure out how to beat something. And then by the time you do, it doesn't really matter. Because it's too late. See, I wonder what's down there. Because it seems pretty awesome. But I'd rather not take the risk. I just want to have as much health as possible for the uh, for the boss fight, basically. <laughs> Which console was the game? Oh, uh, so hey, first off, high squirrel power. Um, so originally the game was on NES. It was the OG. Um, so one of the things that I like that they did with the remastered one is um, they, they have like the old school MIDI style theme song play on the, um, on the title screen. It's kind of neat. But yeah, it was, it was on the NES. Dang it. I think I get a cake though. I think most of the remasters that we're seeing are from those far older consoles. I mean, I guess we have like the um, the the classic consoles. So we've got like the NES and the SNES and the PlayStation Classic. And Dang it. cycles this guy is going to have. I hope it's not a lot. Okay. Oh, geez, this is different. Ah, oh, come on. That counted. Oh, no! Oh, ho, ho, I barely made it. I'm missing the wiggle. That's <laughs> your nemesis in this game? Well, of course. Ah! I don't understand how to dodge this. Like, I was doing the best I could. But it just, it wasn't good enough. Yeah, the, the bats in this game, though, in general, are ridiculous. Like the whole, they dive bomb you as soon as you're above them type of thing. It's just annoying. Ah, oh, see? That's the exact same thing that happened last time. I just overshot it. It's ridiculous. Yeah, I think the little wiggle wobble... From the from the bat is making it so that I can't jump on it quite straight. All right, so now let's see what we got. Oh shoot! This is new. New thing. New thing. Don't know what to do. Dang it. Okay. I beat that section. 
suspicion at least. I mean, I... It seems like I sort of understand. Oh, see! I was... That's what I mean. I'm like barely missing the hitboxes on these guys. You know, honestly, I prefer this one. Oh, come on now! Shoot. Ugh. I'm not a fan of this whole, this isn't even my final form, dude. Homeboy has like eight forms. He needs to calm down with all these forms. That was very close. I got kind of lucky. How dare you? Like a mad you Should call him Formula. <sighs> See? I can't duck fast enough. Like seriously, that was my issue is I, I get where I need to be, but like, just a fraction of a second too late. And see, you can tell that this was an NES game because everything is like punishingly difficult. But, very similarly to something like Dark Souls, which I believe is based off of all NES games ever, is that it's still fair, it's just really annoying. <laughs> Basically, that's all it boils down to. No, not this one again. So it seems like you just need to be between the teeth and ducking and you're okay. All right, cool. Give me ultimate power. Okay, bat again. Not a fan. Oh, what the F? I'm sorry, but that was that was some serious B all up in this S. I do not approve of what happened. So same deal. Oh come on! Please tell me it just needs like one more. Oh yes, dragon dude. have to fight Magicka because I lost the treasures. I also still need my nephews. Ah! Well, that helps. Oh, boys. I'm so glad you're all right. We knew you'd save us. We knew you'd save us. We sure did. Down that hall of ours, the launch pad will be waiting to take you to safety. What about you, Officer? Ah, oh, shoot. Yeah, the whole place. Magic and Glongo still have my number one dime. And God I'm dang not it. Even without it. You boys get going. Good luck, Alan Scrooge. Can it at least be a different level so that I have, like, a give save point? Dime. Not till you give me those treasures. Ah. I want to be filthy, stinking rich. Ah. You already are filthy, stinking rich. See? This is what I mean. Chisel, my duck. Where's the treasure? No more horseplay. I need that guy. Oh, no, you don't, Missy. Ah, let go, you fool. No, till I get that treasure. <sighs> See? 
See, like, it didn't let me, it didn't let me heal, which I'm frustrated by. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, this is bad, you guys. Oh, come on! Oh, come on! Well, shoot. I figured that this was just a straight up race, and I lost. No! God dang it! God dang it! I blame Rev. Rev, why do you do this to me? Why do you hate me so much? Come on! It doesn't even. Ah! Oh. This is why everybody hated NES games, and still does hate NES games. Can't skip this garbage. Oh, son of a bisquick. You see, I said bisquick be because Marathon and Tiny went to get pancakes, so it's okay. That was just ridiculous. We gotta start all the way back here. I don't even care about treasure right now. I just want to move. Like, seriously, I just want to finish this. I'm so close. Absolutely ludicrous. But again, like this is, I mean, this is what I remember from playing NES games, is that they're kind of lame and cheesy and very painful. For once, I'm going to get this treasure chest. Shocking, it's a ruby. <sighs> Stupid rats. Jeez. And rice. Freaking rats. I hate the bats so much. I know I can survive this at least. I'm just trying, I'm trying to get to that last part because I get the cake. I don't remember if there's any healing items in between now and then. I don't think there are. Stupid bats. Uh, <laughs> And what sucks is that this has to be the last time that I try this. I, I, I've got to get going, unfortunately. i got to get to work. So after all this, it may not matter. Oh, come on! I jumped. That was some other BS. It was some decidedly additional BS. I should be able to get the cake at least. I'll be a little bit more careful. <laughs> this is ridiculous, you guys. I got cake. So this is good. We're still in an okay place. Like I said, I'm not gonna bother with treasure stuff. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna try to do this. Cause this is insane. And now I know that last part is just a straight up race. So I gotta go as quickly as I can. Um, the problem is I haven't seen most of it. I've only seen that first little section. But I know how to beat the Count Dracula duck homeboy. Because now I've actually done it! Haha! I still wonder how you even get down there. Oh shoot. Didn't mean to do that. Oh! 
Oh god, no! No! Oh, son of a biscuit! This this game just does not want me to succeed, does it? I think that's all it is. The game has it out for me, clearly. That is the problem here. Ah, see, I did it again. That's the exact same thing I did last time, too. Okay. Yeah, thanks, game. Okay. This part, I always get hit once or twice. I said. Always meaning the last two times when I've been here. I know I said I didn't care about treasure, but that was a lie. Oh, that that was my bad. Okay, here we go again. I'm trying to remember. I think I'm playing on normal, if memory serves. In case anyone was curious. No! What are the bats? God, see? They drop so fast! It's ridiculous. You know what really sucks, though, is the fact that um, it doesn't really matter whether or not I lose health here, because in the next section, at least from what I saw, I don't get hurt. I don't get damaged. I just need to climb fast. That's literally all it is. Oh, shoot. Ooh, that was odd. I don't know. It seemed like the game was slightly feeling sorry for me on that one. I'm ready for the yellow one. Green again. I'm thinking the game is just really feeling sorry for me at this point. And it's just like, oh, poor stupid Danny. Doesn't know how to game. <laughs> like, really, that's that's my thinking at the moment. Okay, now we got this homeboy. But see, now I'm basically an expert at beating this dude. I'm basically a speedrunner at this point. Green again, wow. I don't know, I, this has to be game feeling sorry for me, right? There has to be like a pity subroutine that it's running right now. I mean, that's the only thing that makes sense. Okay, here we go. Oh. But I'll be taking my dime with me back to Duckdog. 
Have a lovely time together. Ah, oh, dang it! This is intense, you guys. It's so intense. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. God! <laughs> this game sucks! This game sucks! I hate it. I hate it so much. I hate everything. I hate it all, you guys. I'm gonna buy some stuff. <laughs> I'm gonna buy some sketches. random sketches and maybe some concept art feel better about myself I'm gonna buy some pencil renders such bullcrap it's bullcrap I tells ya okay sucks oh well well now we have a place to go, at least. And so, unfortunately, I have to keep going. I'm sorry, I couldn't do it. I couldn't make it. It was this close. It was so close. I'm gonna go swim in my money. I'll cheer me up, right? But yeah, I'll, I, I gotta get going. <sighs> you all take care of yourselves. And at the very least, we know that I can pwn Dracula Duck, or Count Dracula Duck, whatever it is. Whatever, whatever the terrible attempted pun was. Ugh. Oh well. Life is like a hurricane. But yeah, so, um, so this is the title sequence and the title song from the original game. And so that's why it has that, um, that very computerized quality to it, because originally it was on NES. But either way, you guys take care of yourselves. Have good weekends all around. Hope that everything goes well. I'll be back on Monday. Um, honestly, not sure what I'm going to play on Monday. Um, I'm, I'm still leaning towards Dragon Quest just to see what the end game for it is, um, since I finished up the canonical storyline. But yeah, either way. You all, you all take care of yourselves. Have a good time. Have a great weekend. And um, Rev, good luck with the house. Hope that everything goes well with the move. Hope that it goes smoothly whenever you start doing it. But you all take care, and I will see you on Monday.